writing phrases for the introduction. It is widely believed that. It is generally acknowledged that. It is commonly claimed that. It is frequently asserted that. It is widely accepted that. It has been established that. A significant number of people think that. A lion's share of people believes that. A considerable number of tourists or visitors. An overwhelming number of children or students. A substantial amount of money was spent. More and more people throughout the world. One of the burning issues of today's world. It is becoming more and more evident that. There is a growing concern about. Researchers are in a consensus that. It has a positive connotation with why. It has a negative connotation with why. It is generally recommended that. It must be admitted that. There is a widespread agreement that. There is growing evidence that. Anecdotal evidence suggests that. In many countries around the world. In many modern industrialized societies. According to a recent survey conducted by. Most governments are showing concern over. There has been significant development in. Writing phrases for different perspectives. From a global perspective. From a local perspective. From a scientific perspective. From a technological perspective. From an ethical perspective. From a cultural perspective. From an aesthetic perspective. From an emotional perspective. From an educational perspective. From a recreational perspective. From a religious perspective. From a psychological perspective. From a social and economic perspective. Writing phrases for neutral views. It is highly debatable whether or not X justifiable. It is questionable whether X is acceptable or not. A controversial argument of recent years is whether. This is a subject that always causes controversy. X has long been the subject of intense debate. There are both positive and negative sides. There is strong emotion on both sides. There is a basic contradiction between X and Y. 
the issue has polarized public opinion. This essay will discuss both sides of this issue. The argument for and against will be discussed. In this essay, both pros and cons of X will be discussed. The essay attempts to deal with both viewpoints. Writing phrases in favor of the topic. An additional argument in support of. Most scholars tend to agree with. One convincing explanation in favor of. People are inclined to believe that. The most powerful argument in favor of. People who adhere to this concept often claim. The proponents are of the opinion that. The backers hold a strong opinion on. The most convincing explanation offered by. Writing phrases against of the topic. One compelling argument against. Some researchers oppose the view that. This argument is no longer widely held. Many people find it difficult to agree with. The advocacy groups tend to be against. The interest groups tend to be against. Another persuasive argument against. Writing phrases for causes. Various factors have been blamed for. X has always been a prime driving force for. It is a combination of many factors. Many problems can arise as a result of. X has a powerful influence on Y. One leading cause which can deteriorate Y. One root cause that may intensify the problem. There is a significant correlation between X and Y. There is a direct connection between X and Y. There is an interconnection between X and Y. Writing phrases for advantages. The most obvious advantage of X. One of the most important advantages of. The most significant benefit of. Another positive view of this issue. The beauty of the such method is that. The strength of the such method is that. An additional merit of X. Writing phrases for disadvantages. The theory has now been disproved by. This hypothesis of often refuted by. The opponents challenge the theory of. There is a strong bias in favor of. 
the theory is based on erroneous beliefs. This claim makes little sense especially. I find this claim unjustified in two respects. There is considerable concern about. This theory seems to have no basis in fact. There is no scientific basis for this method. These claims seem to be completely baseless. Scientists have raised strong criticisms of writing phrases for agreement. I entirely agree with. I fundamentally agree with. It is absolutely right to say. There is ample reason to support. I am utterly convinced that. I am inclined to agree with. I agree with it to a full extent. Writing phrases for disagreement. I am totally opposed to. I totally disagree with. I am completely against. I think it is unjustifiable to say. I remain unconvinced that. I find it hard to agree. It is a paradox that. Some people mistakenly believe. I cannot altogether agree with. Writing phrases for solutions. X is a complex issue with no clear solutions. More attention should be focused on. All possible measures should be taken to. There is no single panacea for the problem. Measures like this would be difficult to enforce. Official authorities should take steps. More attention should now be focused on. A further way to tackle this issue. This problem can be effectively solved by. The only permanent approach to this problem is. Writing phrases for opinion. In my opinion. I tend to think. From my point of view. As far as I am concerned. I am quite convinced that. Having said this, I think. From my perspective. I am of the opinion that. I cannot help thinking that. Writing phrases for restatement. Taking everything into consideration. All things considered, one can conclude. It is apparent from the above argument. On the basis of the points mentioned above. 
based on the argument cited above. Based on the argument mentioned above. According to the points mentioned above. Writing phrases for conclusions. There are more benefits than drawbacks. The advantages of X outweigh the drawbacks. The benefits of X are greater than the risks. There are many problems inherent in. I think X is more of a hindrance than a help. It is difficult to reach a consensus about. 